Welcome to Medical Insight, a weekly spotlight on medical advances, treatments, and wellness. Brought to you by the physicians of the Duluth Clinic. Here is your host, Kim Kaiser. Cardiovascular disease is still the number one killer in America. But new technologies have given physicians more tools than ever in the war against heart attacks and strokes. Today on Medical Insight, we'll talk to Duluth Clinic physician Dr. Michael Luca about coronary CT angiography. Well, uh, basically, the, uh, the CT angiogram is a uh, non-invasive test uh, to uh, image the coronary arteries. Um, and it involves uh, basically a CT scan where a patient comes in and we put them through the scanner and we inject some contrast or dye uh, into the vein. Uh, uh, and that gives us a clear picture uh, uh, as this dye moves through the, uh, the right side of the heart to the left side. It gives us a clear picture of the coronary arteries. The, the whole preparation time is about one hour, uh, you know, from start to finish. And, and again, the actual scan is less than 30 seconds. Coronary CT angiography works a lot like an X-ray of the blood vessels of the heart. This lets physicians view the narrowed and clogged arteries that can lead to heart attack or stroke. So far, we've we've had uh, we've had good results. So we've probably saved uh, a lot of people from having to have an invasive coronary angiogram. On the other hand, we've found some people who we didn't think had, you know, significant blockages who did have significant disease and ended up having an angiogram and and uh, either a stent or bypass surgery. So it works both ways. Not everyone is a candidate for coronary CT angiography. Ask your physician for more information on this procedure. For Medical Insight, I'm Kim Kaiser. For more on coronary CT angiography, call our information line at 786-3107 or log on to smdc.org.